Hello everybody and welcome back to another Rocket League information video. Now this video is going to be explaining everything about the new Rocket League anniversary update that will be dropping in a month on July 5th. Now this update has so much new stuff like new Ritas, new cars, new items, and even a new crate. Now let's get into further detail. Alright guys, so it was just revealed on stage at the RLCS Season 3 World Championships that there will be an update that will arrive early next month. Now, Rocket League was originally released on July 7th, 2015, so next month is the second year anniversary of Rocket League. And they are calling it the Anniversary Update. So, two years of boost-fueled, rocket-powered soccer action. But how are they celebrating it? this? Well, there is a sick trailer that I'm going to show you in just a second. And that I'm also going to break down for you guys so you can see all the new stuff in detail. I'm going to shut up now and let's get to the trailer. Was that sick or what? But before I get into it, I'm going to talk about a few new things that are going to be added. So, there is a new free arena coming to the game called the Champions Field. Now, this celebrates pure competition found in Rocket League, and it's complete with a massive statue featuring our SHIELD logo triple-decker seating, and enough stadium lighting to make your match visible from outer space. This new free arena will be found in all competitive and online playlists, and will be available in private matches as well. The next thing we see is only described by Beautiful, a new rocket trail that looks like it came from Back to the Future. It is the simmering flames that you get when you go into supersonic mode. There is more to this new rocket trail, so let's get into it. Alright, so the following consists of information about the end of Season 4, Season 4 rewards, and competitive Season 5 beginning. So, our anniversary update also marks the end of competitive Season 4 and the beginning of Season 5. We will have a full breakdown of what's coming in Season 5 closer to the update, but in the meantime, you should know that the timing of this seasonal changeover marks how we plan to approach new seasons going forward. In other words, no more long, drawn-out competitive competitive seasons. The end of competitive season 4 also means that a new wave of season rewards are coming. Each rank, bronze, silver, gold, platinum, diamond, and champion will have their own reward, while grand champion gets the champion reward plus an in-game title. As for the rewards themselves, we're doing some much different something much different this time around with new trails as the rewards. Trails, as they will be called after the anniversary update is live, are activated when you achieve supersonic speeds. The white, purple, blue trailer you see behind your battle car can now be replaced with your season trail reward or with other custom trailers we will be rolling out in the future updates and crates. 
Next up, we have one of the new import battle cards called the Sentio V17. Now, this card is super sick, and it is, as I said before, an import battle card that you will be able to achieve in the new crate. Let's check out the other import battle card. The next import battle card that you see right now is the Animus GP. Now, you can see two, and they look freaking sexy another thing i want to mention is the wheels on this import battle car now they are definitely new and probably in the new crate so you should expect to see them with the anniversary update new crate sends rocket league into overdrive speaking of crates the anniversary update will also include the new overdrive crate along with an awesome assortment of new wheels decals black market items the Overdrive crate has two new battle cars, Animus GP and Sentio V17. Overdrive crates will be available as limited drops after online matches. As for the rest of the anniversary update, we have a ton of additional content coming next month, including updated engine audio systems, new soundtrack options, new achievements and trophies, goal explosions, and more. We will have more updates and patch notes as we draw closer to the anniversary. Anyways, guys, now it's the trailer review where I review parts of the trailer and show the new stuff that they'll be adding to the game. Now, first off, there's obviously the new Champions Arena that you're gonna, that you're seeing gameplay in the background right now. A free new arena coming, and obviously this update is for celebrating two years. So the Champions Field is very new and looking very sexy. I want to mention again the new import battle cars as you can see on their wheels they have probably some new wheels and those are the wheels on the Sentio V17 that I've already reviewed and you can probably expect to see those wheels in the crate. Now there are also apparently three new goal explosions that just look absolutely amazing and it looks like one is associated with each element that most people use in games. Fire, ice, and void or magic or whatever there are also new trails and new engine sounds on this car again we can see new wheels and they might be painted pink and finally there are 18 new songs now this is all i found if you found something that i haven't make sure to comment and make sure to like subscribe and comment what you thought on this video and i want to know if you're just as hyped as me for July 5th. Thank you for watching and I hope to see you all in the next video.